हाय लर्नर्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल सच वी आर गोइंग टू सी टुडे द सच टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चंस आर यूजुअली आस्ट इन द मैथ्स ओलंपियाड सो लेट अस सी लाइक मेनी ऑफ देम गेट स्ट्रक इन दिस प्रॉब्लम सो लेट अस सी हाउ टू कैलकुलेट द वैल्यू ऑफ नाउ दिस इज द क्वेश्चन गिवन ओवर हियर सो नाउ uh this is the question is without uh, uh, this one just i have circled it for your convenience actually the question is here without any circle so now i just circled it this one can you see this one why did i circle that one because actually it is in the mixed fraction so before what are we going to do in this question first we are going to make that mixed fraction to the improper fraction and then we'll think about the brackets otherwise if there is no mixed fraction in it always we do the round brackets first and then the um, square brackets and you know the round brackets this is one the square brackets is this one curly brackets is this one okay so i'll show you step by step so i have circled this because first thing we are going to do we can see many of the mixed fractions over here that we are not going to change any bracket over here and we are going to solve this problem so 2 by 5 is as it is this we have to you know how to make it to mix two improper one this will be multiplied by this will be 18 18 plus 4 is 22 no, uh, the denominator remains the same so 22 by 9 now look at this one 12 sends 84 84 plus 5 means 89 by 12 this is 20 20 plus 3 is 23 by 4 don't look at this first Now this is forty four, forty four plus one forty five, forty five divided by two. And don't look at the cuttings first. Our uh, here is um, uh, here you can see for the cuttings here uh, here because now this is not directly done here. So I did here this step over here itself. So here now two nines are and two fives are. So this is going to be twenty five by nine. And so now we are at this step. After doing. Uh, adjusting this one, and now we are going to concentrate on the bracket. So now, can you see this? This is the round bracket. So first thing we are going to concentrate on the right round bracket, and all the other numbers are the same. So what are we going to do? Now, can you see this round bracket? So in the round bracket, what you can see here, you can see twelve, and here you can see only four. Uh, this is a fraction. So what are you going to do? This also denominator you are going to make it to twelve. So four times three. So how? Then with a different color for your understanding. So four times three is twelve. So you have multiplied this by three. So this also should be multiplied by three. Other things all are going to be the same. You are not going to change. Now see here, this same, this same. So now what you did get? This will be. Uh, now you got twelve over here, right? So now uh, look at here. This will be eighty nine minus. When you multiply this, you get sixty nine. And well, you don't have to write twelve. Twelve uh, two times. You can just write twelve, or you can just write one step. Eighty-nine divided by twelve minus this will be sixty-nine divided by twelve. You can just put here one step if you want. So, I'm sorry for that. So you can put this step if you want. Uh, just look at this step. So that will be eighty-nine divided by twelve minus sixty-nine divided by twelve. So this will be in the bracket, and then the, again this will be same as it is, plus twenty-five by nine minus four by five. Okay, this. If you want, you can put this one more step, and then what happens here? Eighty-nine minus sixty-nine divided by twelve. This is same. This is same. This is same. Now see here. Now again, this is not done. This will be same. This will be same. We are going to consider the bracket is not gone. So what will we do when we subtract this? Means this is going to be twenty. Twenty divided by twelve. This all same. Now see here. This all same. So now what we can do? We can make it this thing. We will make it smaller first. So it goes with four. See, twenty divided by twelve. So it goes with four. So what is is that going to be? Five by three. So I did it here, or you can do it separately. Five by three, and this also is the same. So I wrote here five by three. This all same. Forty-five by two. This all same. So now what are we going to do? See now you have to concentrate on this one because this is division. So uh, in fractions you must assign five by three divided by forty-five by two. So what are you going to do? This is a left hand side. That left hand side I'll just write it here. That will be as it is. But this uh, division you have to make it to multiplication. So when you do this multiplication, this gets flip over, or you can write the reciprocal. So this goes up and this goes down. So that is going to be two by forty-five. That is what I wrote over here. Hope you got this. So that division is gone, and then this as it is first. This also as it is first. 
So now we are going to, this is separate, isn't it? So what are we going to do? Five ones are five, nines are, and the rest remain the same. So now look at here. This remains the same. This also remains the same. Now we are going to concentrate on this square bracket. So what is that going to be? This one into two is going to be two. Three into nine is going to be 27. And now you will put this with this one because it is in the bracket. And this will remain the same. Because the bracket, unless you complete that bracket, you are not going to look at the numbers. You are going to write it and there will be more steps. So don't worry about it. This will be same. This will be same. This will be same. Now see here. Can you see the denominators? This is just 29, 27 and this is 9. So you have to make it to because this was 9. This is 27 and this is 9. So it came to 27 and 9. So now again, this you have to make it to 27. So I have multiplied by 3. So now this is 27. So multiplied by 3 means also this also should be multiplied by 3. So now look at here. This is 27. So 25 multiplied by 3 means 75. This same. Now still this is not gone. The bracket is not gone. This same, this same, all same. Now what I'm going to do is so both the denominators are same. So you will add this one. So 2 plus 75 this all same still the bracket is not gone so i've circled it this same all same now uh, this will be 75 plus this is going to be 77 now the bracket is gone because it is a single number so now what again what happens here this will be same now can you see this part this is a division so first thing you are going to remove that division sign so how are you going to write for this one 22 by 9 the left hand side as it is for the division we can make it to multiplication since you made it to multiplication this is going to be the reciprocal this will go up and this will come down so that will be 27 by 77 so this is what i wrote hope you got this one so this 4 by 5 will be same so now what i have done for this one because uh, this is again simplified so 9 times 1 9 times 3 that will be 27 means 27 divided by 9 will be 3 is it so now see here this goes with also 11, 11, 7, 77, and this will be 22. So yeah, if you want, I can write it like this. So this also goes with 11. This also goes with 11. So that will be 2 by 7. So this 2 and 7. And this will be as it is. Now just concentrate on this part, huh? because this is going to be the same. So 3 times 2 is 6. And this 1 times 7 will be 7. So this you got it. This will be the same. Now can you see now? It became so small but now everything the all the fractions all the multiplication everything is gone so whenever now you have plus and minus now you will always go from left to right so now you don't have to worry because even if it is minus and plus here also you will go from left to right so now see now again look at the denominators so when you take the lcm of these denominators the lcm is going to be 35 so now see a 5 and 7 if you want i'll just show you the lcm as well five ones are five then this is seven so here, yeah, 7 times 1. So 7, 5 is 35. So here you need, this is already 5 unit uh, extra multiplied by 7. So that is 35. First, let us look at the denominator. Now this here, 7 is already there. You need 5. 5 is already there. You need 7. So since you are multiplied by 7, you are also by 7. 5, 5, 7, 7. So now what will happen? 14, 35, 30, 35, 28, 35. So now what you can see here? The denominators are the same. So you are going to write 21. And then what are you going to do? This together. 14 plus 30 minus 28. So first we'll add this one, two numbers. That will be 44 minus 28 and this 35. So when you subtract this, you get this answer. Hope it is clear. The steps are more, but there is no way. Because even if you miss single step, all your answer is going to be wrong. So follow the rule.